I was originally parked right here. Yeah. But I walked to get out. And I'm like, what the hell? Yeah. And then I thought it was a joke. Hey. Hey, buddy. 37. I was originally parked right here. Yeah. But I walked to get out. And I'm like, what the hell? Yeah. And then I thought it was a joke. And she, she wasn't young here, man. I don't know. It's I better to keep this. Store. Where'd she go? Tree. He's going to save a lot. 25. She went into the Dollar Tree. I wonder if I should keep this closed for the baby. I, I opened it. Okay. Because he went around and opened that door, yeah. so I opened it up to make sure the baby was breathing and everything. Yeah, we got the keys to that. But it was running and stuff. They had the car running. Like he's got a blanket or anything back there? No. Hi. How old does he look? I mean, I don't know. I young. Him, I told the dispatcher. I said he only looked. I I said I've seen him through the window. I said he looks like a few months. Do you want some? I said he, he only looks like a few months young to me, man. I think it's all right for. Yeah. Drink. Look at that. That's crazy, dude. And the lady's not young. I mean, she looks like she knows better than this Comes shit. Comes back to like a 64 year old lady in the car. I don't. Yeah. Oh, trust me, I know. <laughs> oh my god. It'll be a fun day to be a cop today. <laughs> comes back to like a 64 year old. What did she look like? I'll identify her, man. All right. I see her. We'll, we'll wait for her to come out. I see her walk out, but I see her. I'm sure she's in there. I just, I couldn't look at her. It might not be honest. What did she it, look like? It wasn't the, six, she didn't look 64 to me, bro. What, was, what did looking? she look like? She didn't look 64. You left your baby in an unlocked car out here while you go into Dollar Tree. What are you doing? She was asleep, so I just ran, ran in really quick. You can't leave quick. your child out, an infant, in the car. One, it's 55 degrees out with the sun on him. All right? Two, that car's unlocked. Anybody could have came and taken that kid and left. All right? You see how dumb that was? Yeah. Okay. Do you have a license on you? Hang out with this officer for a minute. Your mother's the registered owner of this vehicle? Yeah. What's her phone number? What is going on? You're gonna be getting some paperwork here in a second. So what is your mother's contact information? Do you know what's going on? You're gonna be getting a ticket for endangering children. Okay. So what is your mother's contact information? Why do you need her? In case Medina County Job and Family Services need to contact her. What is her contact information? Phone number for her. What's the child's name? What's that? Jenkins. Middle name? What's her birth date?
So what, she's one, what is she, like 14 months old? Yeah. I mean, do you think it's smart to leave a 14 year old in a car? Unlocked and running? Regardless if you're in Brunswick or not? What is your mother's phone number? Why can't they just call me? What is your mother's phone number? Why can't they just call me? They probably will call you. Did you give that officer your phone number? No. What's your phone number? Are you employed? You're currently unemployed. What is your mother's phone number? I don't understand. I'm of age. What is... Do you live with your mother? Yeah. Is your father there? No. Okay, which phone number? It's not even... She's currently unemployed. She just want to give her mother's phone number. You don't see on the news, baby suffocating in the back of cars, dying, because he's kidnapped, all that stuff. I mean, somebody could have just grabbed your car and your gun with your child. All right? Kayla, you're getting charged with endangering children. You have a court date on the uh, citation right here, 419.22 at 5.15 p.m. in Brunswick Mayor's Court. You do have to appear. If you don't appear, it's not a waivable offense. If you don't appear, they're going to put a warrant out for you. Okay. After this, any subsequent offenses of this is a felony. All right. So continue to leave your child in the apartment nine months or whatever. Then right? this is a very serious thing. All right. It's a first degree misdemeanor. It will be in mayor's court this time. Like I said, do this again and we charge with a felony. All right. Do you have any questions for me? I don't. Um. Yeah. If you have any questions, call the Brunswick Police Department. Don't leave your kid in the car again, you understand? So what's gonna happen is you're gonna go to court, you're going to your plea, the mayor will give you a sentence, right? Likely for your first offense, it's gonna be some type of fine. You can just work out a payment plan, whatever you gotta do. No, we just need one more unit. Um, just make sure you don't do this again. I don't wanna find your kid dead somewhere, seriously. Right? That's why it's such a big issue. All right. I do take this really seriously. Listen, and I get it, it was an error of judgment. It's a learning experience, but so many times parents will walk away. I just thought she would be okay because the car was running and I was right, right I, there. I understand, but you understand somebody can just grab this kid and go. You're lucky it was an off-duty police officer that found him, all right, instead of somebody who just decided they want a kid, all right? You gotta, you gotta keep an eye on her. It happens, and you, all of a sudden you come out and your kid's gone, then what do you do? There's no cameras here. We don't know where she went. You probably never see her again, you understand? It's a dangerous thing, okay? All right, get yourself home, calm yourself down, okay? It's just, it was a mistake, take care of it, and it's over, all right? Just don't do it again, you understand? I don't wanna be looking for your kid everywhere, looking for somebody who kidnaps your kid, you understand? You clearly care about your child. And I'm, I don't think you're a bad parent. I think you made a really stupid decision. Just don't make it again, get it taken care of, all right?